Thanks for joining us. Happening now, Aurora residents and area firefighters are remembering the life of Cadence Harris, a 17-year-old who was one of four people killed Saturday in a crash involving multiple motorcycles. Her visitation is taking place this evening ahead of a funeral tomorrow. Color 10 Sydney Moran is live in Aurora tonight, sharing what Harris meant to her firefighter community. Well, Harris trained with the Aurora Fire Department as part of a program with Aurora High School. That's why you're going to find fire department trucks here at Aurora Baptist Temple, as Harris will receive full firefighter honors tonight here at the visitation and tomorrow after funeral services. We set the truck out and put the uh, morning bunting on it and her gear. Outside the Aurora City Fire Department, flowers and firefighter gear blow in the wind, serving as a memorial for Cadence Harris. She was one of us. She was one of the family. She's going to be missed. Harris was part of the Explorer program, a partnership between Aurora High School and AFD to train teens to become firefighters. She was very enthusiastic about doing uh, firefighter stuff. I mean, it was not... Uh, she never said no to operating the aerial ladder or uh, loading the hoses up in the hose beds. Hurd says Harris spent many hours training, but her budding career has been cut short. It's a tragic that did not need to happen. It's, it's a sad day uh, when, you, when you lose any firefighter, a, a young one that, that had the whole future in front of them. Ebenezer Fire Protection District is covering for AFD during the funeral services. Over a year ago, the district lost Dustin Brandhorst, a volunteer looking to become a full-time firefighter. So it's sad to lose these um, folks that are here wanting to help their community and, and uh, just uh, getting up to that point and then, and then something tragic happens, yeah. The love for Harris continues to grow with people sending out flowers and notes at the crash site and fire station and others showing up to pay their respects to a fellow first responder. There is going to be, <clears throat> excuse me, firefighters from all over are going to be here to honor her even though they didn't know her. That love continues to grow here outside Aurora Baptist Temple as the parking lot is packed with people visiting Harris tonight. Aurora FD says if any other departments want to participate following the funeral service tomorrow, go ahead and call AFD. Reporting in Aurora, Sydney Moran, Ozarks First.